Hi and welcome to another video from the Market Outlook. So in today's video, we'll be going through a trade recap for Zoom and with that, let's dive straight right in. What we have here is the Zoom daily time frame. So back then when we did a tanker analysis of Zoom, it was trading about 340 levels. I'll put the link up here for the tanker analysis video that we did where we show the reasons why we entered long into Zoom. So back then when we saw Zoom trading at these levels, I entered to two positions. The first one was going long 10 shares in Zoom. So that gave me exposure of about 3,400 USD. And if I were to replay this chart, price action, you see prices started to shoot up, buyers coming in. The 8 EMA is holding very well. And you can see the RSI as well is holding above the 50 very well, showing there were good bullish momentum and prices eventually closed yesterday at $387. So my closing range was about $370 to $386. So that gave me a net profit of about $200 plus minus USD, about an 8 to 10% profit. So with that, I think what could have been improved was holding this Zoom shares higher because price action did not close below this 8 EMA and could have held the Zoom shares and hold exposure for zoom longer so that's something that i've taken note of and with that i'll head into my second position which is selling a put spread so essentially when i sell a put spread i receive a premium of about 580 usd so the put spread range was about 330 to about 290 so let me remove the drawings to make it clearer so if i draw the range out 330 to 290 about here so you see this box I've drawn. So essentially when I sell a put spread, sorry, hold on, let me draw this here. So essentially when I sell a put spread, I'm betting that prices will not trade below this 290 level on expiry. So my expiry was about 16th of July. And if prices were to continue to trade sideways or trade above this range, I'll be keeping the full premium of about $590. So if on expiry prices trades below 290, I will be having the max loss of about 3,400, 3,500 USD and that would be my total risk of the trade. So as of yesterday, I closed the Zoom put spread and I managed to keep the premium of about $530. I'll flash the link up there, about $550. I'll flash the screenshot up there if you net the total. And that gives me a return of about a very good 15 to 16% return. So with that, I'm very happy with the put spread position and how the trade played out. I know that some might say that why not hold all the way to expiry you can keep the full premium of 590 dollars but i do not want to risk having prices to pull back down further into this range so with that i took this put spread position out and in total that made me about a very good 15 to 16 percent so with that for those who are holding shares and holding it for long term i don't think that you have to panic sell just because i sold or anything and a very reasonable price target of reaching 432 to about 452 because price action is still looking very bullish and RSI is holding up very well. So with that, I gave a very quick trade recap of Zoom and I hope you enjoyed this video. So if you did enjoy this video, do remember to smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. And with that, trade safe. I'll see you in the next one.